Hey guys, John at the No Shame Income Blog here today to review Arbitrage Underdog 2015, the Black Label Edition. This is actually the very latest edition. Uh, I'm sure if you're going to go out there and look at some other reviews at this point, the software has been out for uh, several years now, I believe. It's been well over a year. Uh, this is the very updated, latest, and greatest version, so I really wanted to give everyone a perspective on what you're getting if you buy this tool in 2015 and you upgrade to the Black Label Edition. Obviously, if you buy regular Arbitrage Underdog, uh, you're going to get um, just a basic edition. It's not going to include some of the extra search enhancements. So first off, you're probably wondering what the software is. If you haven't looked into it already, basically, this was created by um, Tom E. and Chad Rigo. They basically have designed a piece of software that allows you to quickly search Craigslist and at the same time, search Fiverr really quickly. Uh, most of you out there are probably familiar with Craigslist, but if you're unfamiliar with Fiverr, Fiverr is a $5 marketplace. You can buy, sell, um, buy and sell services that are very cheap, only $5 for everything. Um, so the idea of using this software and the reason it's called Arbitrage Underdog is you can go out and basically look for, let's say you go on Craigslist and you find someone that's looking for a logo design. You could then go to Fiverr search for someone that's able to design a logo for just five dollars and you basically become the middleman you you know you go to fiverr have someone design a logo for the five dollars and then you deliver that for something higher like fifty dollars or a hundred dollars to the buyer on craigslist um, i actually did this initially when i first started out using arbitrage underdog and um, let me tell you it does work it takes some effort but um, in the training they really give you some ways you can kind of stand out and Maybe you could do some other tactics, things like um, other higher end jobs, maybe like websites or um, having other graphic work done, business cards, things like that that people could use. Um, there's really just limitless um, potential in what you can really do with the tool. So I did want to give you a quick example. And to be honest with you, using this tool is even faster than using Craigslist. Let's do, I'm going to do this totally. So here it goes. I'm finding um, graphic work. You know, here's someone logo needed, um, and it, it, I can sort by the date, the keyword I search, the city category. Um, obviously, some of these are a little bit older. Um, you can even see whether or not you've emailed people. I think you can send emails straight from this tool. Load in templates, and you know it's pretty crazy. You can even do Craigslist in other countries like Australia, Canada, the UK. So this is what I was able to come up with. Obviously, I only search gigs, but um, let's see. If I double-click this, it opens Craigslist in this window. Looking to get a logo design for my business. I know what I want. Uh, blah, blah, blah. You know, they're saying it's worth $150. Now, if I can go to Fiverr, just type logo. And this thing is going to crank out. Tons and tons of information here. Um, you can probably sort based on the rating. That might be the best way to go. This rating here, Fiverr did make a change uh, fairly recently within the last couple months where um, they're not publicly displaying the ratings like, like they were before, kind of on top of everything. So I'm just going to cancel this now because I've already got, you know, 900 plus gigs here. But you can see here, edit, amend, or update your logo so that's kind of editing an existing logo let's close that and see what else we have replicate design a signature style logo so you get really you know you can dig around yourself just see what kind of reviews people have I mean this particular seller uh, does these like signature ones so you know, obviously they might not be quite looking for that but um, everything on Fiverr is five dollars and then here some of the uh, templates you can use up at the top left if I click logo you can set up um, you know this is basically ready to go you can send this email off to this particular customer and essentially be making money bartering becoming this middleman now you can also search this is the best part of the black label edition if you type in search other I can put in any of these sites Elance, Upwork, Gumtree, Simply Hired, Indeed I think that's Kiji. I'm not familiar with that particular site. People per hour, flexjobs, and guru.com. So you have 
so much potential here. I mean, if I do Upwork and I hit search, let's see what I get. I don't know how long I haven't actually done the Upwork one since they updated it. Need a background for my website. I mean, these are literally work that's come in all within the past 24 hours. People needing stuff, recreate a logo. You know, I just found here, update your logo. I will edit, amend, or update your logo. And here I've got someone saying they want to recreate a logo. Recreate logo. Hi, I need the attached logo recreated as a high res 300 DPI file. Now, obviously, if you do go on Upwork, you are going to find some competition. And this one had 47 applicants. So you will have to kind of weed your way through. Um, I honestly like doing things that are a little bit more in depth. So I'm going to cancel that search. Let's do a search for SEO and see what comes up on Upwork. You know, these might be something that's a little bit more in line with really making some money. You know, people looking for like SEO work, websites, anything that you really have skills at. Um, you don't even necessarily need to have a ton of skills because you can find all kinds of stuff on Fiverr. You can have anything done. You can even do some of the SEO work on Fiverr. So this is just to give you an example of what this tool can do. It's extremely powerful. I actually like it in itself just for the search capabilities. Um, the best deal I had come through with this was I was using it when it originally came out and I went and searched on, um, I think it was in Texas, I searched WordPress and I found a guy trying to sell his WordPress website and basically I ended up talking with the guy and I made over $700 by making a few phone calls to some local businesses letting them know he was trying to sell like a website for leads. Um, it was like in a, in the fence niche and, you know, very expensive niche. So it was really worth it for some of these guys to jump on board with that. So just to give you an example of how the tool can be used, you can just get creative with it. Think of the things you could search for, go through the training in the back end, And, um, like I said, awesome tool, definitely one of my favorite tools that I've used in the last two years in terms of internet marketing.